ito ang wine ng nagdadebut. 18 years old. In the wine region of Armenia, the town of Areni. And you, you are, are watching Igorota in, in the city. city. Yay! Open. <gasps> oh, this is uh, the barrels. Yes? Oh, look at that. It's the wine barrels. Look how big. On our way to the Norovang Monastery, we made a quick stop for wine tasting at one of Armenia's best wine producers, the Arani Wine. A wine barrel was discovered inside a cave on these cliffs and it is said to be centuries old and it is now under the protection of the proper authorities. We are heading to the Noravank Monastery and we are in Noravank. Look at this. It is free to enter the Noravank Monastery. Noravank is an Armenian term meaning new monastery. The monastery is a lovely example of the ornate architecture of the 13th century. The sculptor of the grandest portions of the Noravank monastery was a man by the name Momik. He created the lovely stonework that survives today. The sculptor is also buried on this site. Sitting in a picturesque valley, this monastery is located in a narrow gorge made by the Mago River. This gorge is made of tall, sheer, brick-red cliffs directly across from the monastery. in the heart of the mountains is the Noravank Monastery. Napakaganda mga bakla! The monastery is best known for its two-story Holy Mother of God Church. It grants access to the second floor by way of a narrow stone staircase jutting out from the face of the building, which is one of the earliest examples of cantilever architecture. And it is the grandest structure of the Noravank Monastery. When the Mongols conquered Armenia, they set about destroying many of the historical temples of the country. According to locals, Noravank was spared from destruction because of the image of God which is engraved here. You are now looking at the very image that saves Noravank Monastery from destruction. In here, God the Father cradles the head of Adam in his left hand as Adam receives a breath of life from the Holy Spirit represented by a dove. This carving shows Momik at the height of his artistic powers. 
However, the deep engraving is said to have been the result of human momics deteriorating eyesight. Nora Vank is the second stop on our one day three destinations tour, which cost a hundred US dollars. Yes, because life is adventure. I just heard that. Nora Vank. 